Lord, please open our eyes and let us see those around us that are in need of your compassion. Compel us to listen to them, to hear their needs, and give us the heart to be interested in their troubles and provide for us the means to help them. Amen. Mother Mary began, Prayer has become so impersonal. It is good practice to put your very own relatives in the place of those who are at risk, to help you be more personally involved. In each place where tragedy takes place, there are people similar to your family members who love you. In this way, it becomes far more personal for you. Not only that, but because you prayed for those you do not know, the Lord will cover your interests. When you practice this kind of compassion, you become more like Jesus. That is why mercy and compassion are so important for you. Without it, prayers become rote and dry, not touching the heart of the matter. All over the world, people are languishing and wondering if this is the end. Their sense of insecurity is so strong, it interferes with their living from day to day. You have hope to offer them with a sure knowledge of how much they are loved in spite of their imperfections. The effect of these messages is peace and hope. That is why we continue to give them to you, Claire. They truly reach those who are suffering and afraid. I am here, Claire. Thank you, Mother. I am a bit spacey. I understand. The binding prayer would have helped with that. But here we are, just as it is. So let's make the very best of it. If I could speak the very heart of the matter, it is to convince souls how much they are loved by their God. He intercedes without a break, day and night. When he comes before the Father, he is painfully aware of who has yet to be saved and how necessary the harvesters are. That is why he is encouraging you to make the next step to the Mesa. Claire, there are many lost souls who have sought the truth but felt at such a loss for not finding it. When they do find it, they will be truly born again and ready to live this new life. I heard the Lord's voice. They are also unique souls, some of whom the world is not worthy of. They will recognize truth and be open to miracles and healings of all sorts. Where your faith is lacking, mine is filling in because I want them to experience my love and power. Some have demonic infestations and will require prayer and fasting to be released. I will be with you, Claire, even though in this moment you are struggling to hear me. I am speaking to you and telling you there will be miracles. Lord, when do you want us to begin? You will know there will be an eagerness. After he said this, I heard, a great sign appeared in heaven in the background. Claire? Yes, Lord. Please relax. I will bring it together quite easily. You worry too much. That's not your job. Your job is to believe. 